Hello and welcome to the second part of the vertical axis wind turbine tutorial. In the first part, we analyze the turbine using the moving frame of reference method, which is a steady approach. Now we're going to use a sliding mesh, which is a transient approach. Therefore, we're going to have less simplifications behind. Start from the file from the part one of the tutorial. The first thing you want to do is duplicate the project. Click on the upper left arrow and click Duplicate. Name it Sliding Mesh. Now we want to import all the setup we inputted in the first part. So drag solution from the moving frame of reference into the sliding mesh. This will load all upstream data from the moving frame of reference part into our new sliding mesh part, so we don't have to recreate all the interfaces and cell zones. Also, this will allow us to use the steady solution as a starting point for our transient analysis.